All right, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. So, even though this episode is titled Westbrook, I'm going to start off in Watson Northside. There is a suspected organized crime activity that I missed last episode because I pretty much did all the Watson last episode. Uh, the reason is because you have to do the gig here first. So the gig is called Hippocratic Oath, I believe. Uh, it basically means you have to um, escort a doctor who is in the middle of an operation out of the uh, a maelstrom den and then I don't know if it matters if, she, if you help her save her patient or not I did help her save the patient in both playthroughs and I ended up with a reported organized crime one day later after waiting a good decent pace away like I kept driving until you hit the you know uh, a safe spot an automatic safe spot um, and then um wait 24 hours there come back and then there'll be a whole new cast of characters here that you can take out as part of an organized crime so why did i say all that well when you do that the boss here the one that gives you the crafting spec for the legendary uh, unity has a chance to drop a epic tactician that has uh increases damage from ricochet by 12 percent i've gotten the same exact gun on multiple seeds so that means it's consistent as far as i know uh you can prove me wrong if you want to but now that we've done that let's go ahead and delete all this crap and then we'll go ahead and get on with westbrook so in westbrook we are outside of a factory that was basically they're they, they're not paying their rent um and we're supposed to make them pay their rent oh robot mark two i've never seen that before it's got charge jump though that doesn't make me happy um well i already saved so i might as well just go straight in a breach friendly turrets Ooh. Really see that? Let's go for it. Well, 55, 55, 55. I see, I see. We'll take care of most of it. This is finding the 7A to IC to 7A connection. Actually, I got that. So 55, 55, 55. I see, I see. 7A, I see. 7A. Cool. That was perfect, so we're going to save over that. And then we're also going to hit him with a ping real quick. Ooh. He didn't respect it until I pinged him. Well, sorry, buddy, but you're about to get taken down by this Achilles. And while we're at it, let's, well, actually, instead of doing all that, let's just look for all the other cameras that we can camera control. That looks like a camera. Yeah, it's definitely a camera. Got some ops over there. This is some compound, it looks like. And we're going in. I'm going in, and I'm going to go hard, and I'm going to go hard. What's that? Oh, an Ajax. Nothing special on it. Ooh. I can deck grenade on him. Interesting. What happens if I do? Does he have like a good grenade? I need to check to see what his weakness is. He's hacking. Oh, 
Oh, last ring. Oh, that stunned him. Got a drone over there. Yeah, sure. I need to level that up anyway. Try to find a decent path there. I guess it has to be hard for a non sniper, but for a sniper, this is the easy, easiest cake. It's like, just basically, as long as you kill your opponents in one shot, they don't detect you. Any game turns into child's play. I would say this game did a very good uh, good job of making getting to this power level where I am consistently killing things with one shot and staying undetected. It did a good, great job of like uh number one not making it easy to figure out how to do it, and then number two, um, even if you know how to do it, you're still kind of gate kept from it. The fact that you absolutely need need need. Um, to find some legendary quick hacks and make this the way it works. Okay, we got a got something over here. Um Look out, he's hacking. Oh, I didn't see that. Let's put you on friendly mode. I've never been in this compound before, so this is brand new to me. All of it. Oh. Oh. Remember, robots don't have weak points, so... You just shoot them. With the hardest hitting weapon we can. Would help if I didn't randomly lose. There we go. Guess that's gonna be another flashbang. Yes, it is. Tango down. My main problem is I don't know who would count as a boss here because 
all these enemies are like workers and robots. Ooh, child. Also, want to make sure I don't miss anything. This is a big old factory area. There might be some random weapons with modifiers laying around. Holy crap. Good thing I didn't walk into that too quickly. Is that already friendly? Yeah, it's friendly. Okay, cool. Oh. Dang. Hope the hope this doesn't screw it. Alright, we're good. I was thinking, oh, I should save. I've I've done a lot, <laughs> and then before I could save, that's not a security turret, right? But that one friendly. Ooh. I'm guessing I should go up. Well, there's stairs up there, too. So for being in friendly mode, this thing's trash. Dang. This is exactly what I was afraid of. Just need one bad roll and you're in. Yep. And now I'm stuck in combat. Okay, uh, that's probably, I'm thinking that's a, what you call it, I'm thinking that's a, that's definitely going to be one that I can just save and reload over. Oh, nice. Turret's putting in work now. Guess going into combat was a necessity there. Oh, never mind. Turret put it down for me. Good turret. Not a friendly turret. I've literally never seen this entire area before, so this is really cool. Like, you can go the whole game without seeing so much stuff. Ooh, okay, that looks like a boss. I should have figured a, a mech would be the boss here. So how to handle... Um, I know Sonic Shock would kill him in one shot.
Yeah, let's do it. The Achilles, if I hit a crit, should kill him one shot. And it does. The headsman. Hmm. No likey. Let's try it again. I don't know how far back I was when I took that last save, but hopefully that was pretty close to that point. Oh yeah, that was. Wow, I'm blind. I missed that the entire time. Try one more go. So sometimes, like with the other one I showed you at the beginning of this video, the weapon just doesn't drop. So I don't know if this guy has a weapon or if he doesn't have a weapon. So that's why I'm double checking, triple checking. Just to make sure that the boss of every uh, organized crime actually doesn't have a weapon before I just move on. Alright, I'll accept this. I like how just unnervingly efficient this weapon is on ammo. Like, stupidly efficient. Oh. It's a guy. It was kind of important. Maybe I should ping him. Did I just talk to this man? I feel like I talked to him. Let's try talking to him. Oh, I can't force the door open. What else can I do? Is there literally nothing I can I can do here if I can't force the door open? Bad game design. Why do I have no options? I guess I could shoot at him and have him open the door himself. Yeah, that that'll work. Come on, open the door. Open the door. They do it during, uh, what you call it. Don't fear the Reaper. You should be able to do it during this as well. Oh. There you go. Thank you, Conley. We're back. Thank you. We make a way around here, boy. We're going to figure out how to, how, to, how to figure some stuff out, bruh. We're going to figure that out. What's up in here? Steel pipe? Trash. They thought they was gonna stop me. I be laughing, ha 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 ha, you can't catch him, you can't stop him. I go by them going rules, if you can't beat him, then you pop him. You can't man him, then you mop him. You can't stand him, then you drop him. Pop him, cause we pop him like, oh, red and back Yeah, you close now. I done looted you. Can I actually shoot? That's a good question. Can I just shoot these out? No, nope, can't do that. Oh, yeah, closing that door is permanent. Dang. So whenever you use that trick, you gotta make sure, you know. You're done. You're done done with whatever you're trying to do. Um, I already hacked that one, right? Looks like that's a no. There we go. Thank you, Kyle. Now let's start top these. Oh, 
Oh, so if I'm up high enough, it doesn't recognize me as being within the hostile area. We'll come back and hit that. I think that I think that uh quasar right there, that's a real that's the weapon I'm looking for. I don't hate quasars, but I do hate how overused. Oh, hold up. Oh, uh, I thought. Kunai, huh. Interesting. So there's a kunai up here. I don't know how rare that is, but I rarely ever see it. So that's probably worth knowing about. Let, let me double check. I think Sam Bram said this is one of those super rare ones, right? Or am I tripping? Let me double check, check. Start putting notes. Best melee mods. Kunai. All rare versions available at any weapon vendor. Okay, okay, so you it's not that's not that bad. Uh we can take the hazmat seat. Take all of it. That's unfortunate. I wish they had something rare like a neon arrow or phantom or one of those up here. Alright, so here's the box. Here's the box that has all of our hopes and dreams inside of it. Use that. Oh, well, that's worthless always. Alright, let's go. Right now it has no modifiers. We're hoping that changes. Although I did already reload, so maybe I'm just hoping for nothing. Fingers crossed, guys. Hope we see a something change about that. A rarity change or a modify or something. There it is, there it is. There's your modifier, guys. Cool, awesome. So we found the modified weapon. It's in a Takanaka box. So those that's honestly, anytime you see a fancy weapon box at all, a fancy box at all, just expect that to be a a uh, a weapon. Um It hasn't changed like it hasn't changed uh what you call it for me though hasn't changed rarity so I don't know if it's a confirm quasar or if say if it's a possible quasar I don't really go to my other seat and check on it I'll do that when I uh, release the guide I'll look up all the other uh, as many as I can to see if uh, on if they're uh, confirmed or if they're random but yeah I forgot which gig this was. This isn't a gig. This is a uh special activity. you want to come here before or after beating Woodman or after uh, dealing with Klaus? I think this would be after Disaster Piece, honestly. Yeah. This would be after Disaster Piece, I would say. Epic DR-12. Quasar. What kind of case is this again? Takanaka case. Suspected. 
organized crime activity and how would you describe this location it's like the far northeast kind of sort of Westbrook far northeast hills of Westbrook I'd almost say yeah This is North Oak. To be more specific than Westbrook. Alright, so our next location got an assault in progress, reported crime, assault in progress, assault in progress, assault in progress, reported crime, assault in progress, assault in progress. So I did knock out already a, uh, there was one around here in the Japan town. There was a uh, suspected organized crime that I already knocked out. That gave me the Achilles I'm using now. So I wouldn't be surprised if maybe I accidentally ran out of organized crime. To, to, yeah, it looks like I ran out of organized crimes to bust. Go us. However, I do want to double check. Because I don't remember doing this on this save. I do want to double check that. Uh, uh, Let's go ahead and pick all this stuff up. Do this behind, see if it stays here. See if that box recloses or what have you. Oh, I don't think I've jumped on top of this building. Ooh, there's a ladder. <laughs> okay, can it still get it? How am I supposed to hack this? Oh, from here. Alright, BD 55, BD 1C, I got lucky there because I was not planning that one out. Uh, 55, 7A, 55. How's this area still hostile? What enemy did I miss? I guess that's kind of my question. Is like, yo, what did I miss? Don't see another hackable item. Yeah. I don't know where it's coming from. Oh. Am I getting shot at by a forklift? That was cute, but... They're all way too close together. Should learn not to do that. Oh, wow. So even these guys don't have uh Oh hold up, what am I doing? Just pull these guys up.
Or, or miss. I don't like how I keep. All right, you know what? I do want to snipe these guys with the O5, but it's it just misses way too much. It's just a way faster way to knock these guys out, especially if they're gonna hide behind cover. Know what I mean, know what I mean, Jelly Bean. Way faster to knock them out with the with this kind of action right here. Oh, I see. That's reinforcements that they brought in. It's pretty decent with reinforcements. It's got a defender, a sniper, all kinds of stuff. Anybody else? Buy yourself the stone? Alright, well, you just. You're just having a bad day. Somehow, area is still hostile. All right, we've checked. We've checked everything. Unless there's something on top of the gate that I missed. We've seen it all. What do you mean I can't sell this truck? I'd love to ride around this semi truck real quick. Racism. Let me back up. Alright, never mind. The racism is too strong on this one. Let's go. Oh, and my nice little uh, all white and gold uh, car here. Yeah, so <laughs> that was pretty much the other, because uh, I don't see any more. Um, yeah, I don't see any more organized crimes here in Westbrook, honestly. Maybe I could go up here, like down here and see what pops, but it should have popped when I went that way anyway. So yeah, we should be good to go, I think. Is there any other spot that might have an organized crime? Uh, maybe down here in Charter Hill where the Dyna, yeah, where the Dynalar is. That's a good possibility, actually. Um, so it's like this street right here. No, that's an assault in progress. Oh, wow. So that big old uh, Militech compound is only an assault in progress. That's crazy. All right, if that's the case, then what I do want to do is I want to knock out some gigs. I want to knock out some gigs in Watson. Um, the reason I want to do that is so that... Um, I didn't know we'd have so many other ones. The reason I want to do that is so that... Um, I want to see if any more pop up. Any more um, organized crimes. Just like when I solved a Hippocratic Oath.
Should I start with Hippocratic Oath? Oh, I am doing Hippocratic Oath. Never mind. Yeah. Move. Get out the way. Get out the way, trick. Get out the way. Move, trick. Get out the way. Get out the way, trick. Get out the way. Hold up. I fight out. I'm about to punch your lights out. Get the F back. Guard your grill. Yeah. I've been drinking and busting too, and I've been thinking I'm busting you. I'm such a mutt forehead. And if your friend jump in, all oh, girl, they're mowed in. Causing confusion, disturbing the peace. It's not an illusion. We run the streets. So bye bye to all you goofies and gold diggers. I'm doing a hundred on the highway, so if you do the speed limit, I'm doing almost, well, this is the clicks, but even miles per hour, I'd be doing, I'd be doing a buck thirty by now. I'm D, why never hardly caught sober, and you are about to get ran the us over. Shout out Ludacris. That's from the classics. Also, it's guaranteed to start a fight in any club you go to. I'm just going to warn y'all. I could have tried to push through that, but I was just like, yeah. Matter of fact, next time I will try to push through that, do the roadblock. I just love how Maelstrom's just such a menace that they can just do that. All right, so remember that beginning video I was talking about? Uh, you have to do a particular quest, a particular gig in order to unlock a um, an organized crime here in Watson. Well, this is that gig. This is Hippocratic Oath. It's pretty simple: kill everybody and then move forward. That type of deal. I really need to get rid of camera shutdown. Because it's not useful. It really isn't. The problem is, when you use camera shutdown, it just... It works against you. It works against what you're actually trying to do. Fifty-five. How many E9s are there? Okay, there's a few. But it's not going to be easy. Seven, eight, E9. One C, one C. Okay. Uh, I gotta remember to start. I didn't remember that time, but I gotta remember for 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 uh, to always save after I do a breach. How am I in combat? You saw me. You didn't see me. You thought you saw me. Finish the cunt. What's this him this time? That memory wipe is strong. Everybody else can't go into combat, theoretically. They still can, but it's not as easy. see it.
There you go. I need a ping. I can't see anybody. I really already took out the ringleader. Oh, that's fire. Above me, there's an access point. That's close. By the way, that was Sonic Shock's ability that kept them from hearing me. I can smell your fear. You don't shit in your pants yet? Shit in your pants yet? There you go. Dang, you almost had me. Almost. I hate sniping from behind because it's like whether you hit their head or not, it's like it craps you. Are you serious? One shot and that burning damage flatlined me. Okay, you know what? I want to do it the nice sneaky way. We're gonna do it the my way this time. And by my way I mean just the very very oh, I'm already inside. Well, it's not gonna take that long to make it knock him out. I don't need to wait for that. All that matters is that I hit. I don't need to charge either. There. Sometimes you can just brute force it with your precision rifle. That was one of those times. Um. Yeah, no, if I follow that, I don't get anything out of it. 
All right, so where do, where do I get to a 1C7A? That works. 1C7A. Doesn't work. Oh, there it is. PD55 or PD1C. That's extra annoying that it's like it, does, it never works. Alright. So annoying. I hate it. I hate it my life. Oh, man. Oh. Did I not get, pick that up already? Lame. I just need one C from somewhere. One C. That's screwed. I don't care. Hey, when things get unnecessarily hard. It's like I've got how many levels in? I've got so many levels in. Reach for a call, 11 levels, right? So theoretically, like I get it, like if you go up to 20, it makes things a ton easier. I just wish that they made it easier at level 16, like they made a quick hacks a lot more powerful at level 16. I wish they made it. Reach for a call a lot stronger. Now, granted, Reach Protocol is very useful, but it's just really annoying and time consuming. I'm not part of the gang. I know. Look, we don't. We can't be. Pressure's falling. Same with the temperature. He's going into shock. I'll try to stem the bleeding. You give him a unit of synth blood. Come on, it's on the table. First from the left. Man, annoying. I think you do have to save him in order to unlock the next thing. Just not in my hand. <sighs> okay, gotta wait a bit before it closes up. Why are you do? Name Hans Otto. I'm gonna see if Hans Otto is still here when we come back. Hans Otto. Keep close to me. Head down. Yeah. On, just a little farther. Probably she already knew the way up. You ride, get in. Alright, cool. Should be good to go. Next one.
Remember, guys, we gotta remember Hans Otto. Otto. Thievery. And while we're at it, start writing stuff down. Um. One good thing about this build, uh, not not having good cyberware, is that it forces me to pick stuff that's like kind of trash. Um, so I end up uh, just trying out different things than normal. Everything's maxed out, so I just go ahead and put that anything that isn't with it. Actually, I should have did this way to begin with. Almost about level two. Actually, hmm. hey, Lucy, safe. Cream work. Thanks. Oh, well, talking about leveling. There's our level. Tech eighteen. You know what time it is, boss. You know what time it is. That could be useful. But most important thing is Edron Artisan. It's, that's the most important thing to get. And then we can look around here. Uh, yeah. Reduce our charge times even further. Um, so right now my charge time with Achilles is... 0 0.9 seconds, right? Yep, because it's already reduced by 50%. Let's, but honestly, that's the weird part because it says reduces it by 50%, but it reduces it by more than 50%, it's like 53%, because it reduces it from 1.9 to 0 0.9. And it does have extra decimals, it's not rounding, it does have extra decimals. Like, it, if you use the uh, version where it says reduces by uh, stat O, it'll reduce it. By like 12.5 percent, which it comes out to 1.66, so it does have extra decimals to play with. It just reduces it by a full second. So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see what happens here. Let's give it a shot. I want to see how much this reduces our. So when I hit the 10 percent. Charge time still at 0 0.9. Oh man, am I not going to be able to see the change? That sucks if I can't see the change. 20%. Still 0 0.9. That sucks. I wonder if it's... Uh... Try to get some speed. Wow. You guys saw that, didn't you? <laughs> they tried to build the, but they just built it wrong. I know the game's glitching, but that's funny to me. It's 
Pyro Psycho. Not really worried about that. Like, oh, that's the Bloody Ritual one. Yeah, nah, not interested right now. That's like the second hardest Pyro Psycho to deal with. Maybe fourth. Like, it, it depends on what you're trying to do. Like, Cyber Cycles on, in builds, it's like... Oh, hold up, hold up. Can we get up the ramming speed? That's that's the question here. Can we get up the ramming speed? Oh, yeah, yeah. I could easily ram that. They could have they saved themselves some time. I didn't even built that. Recording of a maelstrom initiation. Wanna know more? Check what I attached. Oh, even naked ox. Well, I think I've done this before actually. That kind of saddens me though that uh I didn't get any anything. At all? Oh, okay. Okay. So now I've got a point five second charge time. So theoretically, all right. Base charge time is. And let me just double check that I don't have any other charge time reducers. Reducers on engineering here. So it only increases armor from there, from the attribute, and then looking at here, perk point, armor, charge time. Oh, yeah, decreases charge time by 5%. Crit chance by 1%, 4%, thermal resistance, crit chance. All right, so we've only got an extra 5%. So we've got 75% reduction in charge time, right? So that 1.9 was probably something different. I don't know what it, let me see, divided by 1.05. No, that's not the right way to do it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to reverse, get to where it was. I wonder if it's just like 2.0 times 0.95 makes 1.9. So it standard has a 2.0 charge time. Okay. All right. I think that's the standard charge time for Achilles is 2.0 because with that 5%, it brings us down to 1.9. So here's my theory. It's, it's not multiplicative. It's additive right so these things they kind of just add on to each other so the next charge time reduction was 50% but it's not 50% of the remaining 0 1.9 it's 50% of 2.0 which was one second which is why I dropped down to 0 0.9 so I don't know if there's any way to how do I do this uh so every time it does the math, it does the math using two point Right? So so it's minus I almost don't want to multiply, I almost want to go minus five percent equals one point nine. And then we can just say minus 55% is 0 0.9. That's what I had before. And now I've added more. Yep, minus 75%. That's 0 0.5. So right now we have a quarter of the charge speed. That is bananas. All right. And that's fully charged, just like that. Okay, cool. You couldn't see when the car, but now that I'm outside, yeah. We're at a quarter charge speed. Yeah, that's absurd. Okay, let's 
going, get her done. Okay, so we got a surveillance camera. Gonna go ahead and hit it with the friendly. Then we'll also hit these guys with as much stuff as we can. Well, besides camera shutdown, I really need to get rid of that. I keep saying it, but I really do. Uh, 55, CE9, somewhere please. Okay, I got it. And then. I'll try to figure it out from there. 55, 1C, or 59, 55, E9, 1C, 7A. Okay, we got that as well. Alright, in this particular case, it looks like uh, we got a lot of people. I don't see too many other cameras. Let's try to ping the whole building. I don't see any other cameras. Alright, well. We're going to sonic shock him, just to make sure he doesn't make a sound. I can't have you giving away your death. There we go. Ooh. Well, you're really far by yourself. Wait, he's still alive? Ooh, that's not good. I'll try to circle you. That's annoying. That's really annoying that he lived through that. You guys saw the headshot, and he was moving, which means I got extra bonus damage from that. Uh-oh. Coming outside. If I'm not mistaken, there's a way inside from like over here somewhere. Door through this window, please. I just want to. I just. I just want to look cool. Can I please get through the window, please? Ah oh, man, that was almost so cool. If I got through the window like that, you know how cool that would have looked. Like, I'm ninja. Yeah, no, nah, I'm just humping the window at this point. I'm sure you can get out of the window, you just can't get in it. That irks me so bad. That's... What about this one? Oh, that's neat. Oh, but I can get in through this one. Racism.
Not even to get me nowhere. I'm literally right by the door. I guess I could have snuck up on these guys from behind. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh. And. Wasting my time. Like, y'all gonna stop me. Them dang cameras. Um. I'm guessing I can open that door with the terminal. Probably. No, I can't. Fifty-five, one, C7A, C9. I like when they're easy like that. Even at the end, where it's just a little bit challenging because. What? Why y'all got so many cameras? Now they see me through walls. Only I can peek through walls. I think I went that way already, yeah. Uh. Ooh, hold up. Hopses is around. Um, I don't think there's a good way to do this. I think I just ping. And then with the... Hit this guy with a dead grenade. He looks tougher. Oh, never mind. You got him up for one shot. Must be a big grenade. Yeah, every once in a while they take a break from torturing people to um, play cards. They like spades. What else from sounds like spades playing organization. Yo, when I come back here, I need to make a, a note of places that I need to come back to with uh, legendary gorilla arms. Because that's annoying. Uh, I think I blow those guys up, right? I think that's the right way to go about this. I'm about to run out of experience. Time. Uh, BD 7A, 55 7A. Let's see, let's see, 7A, BD. Let us see it. Are you serious? Darn. Well, 
those guys up. Oh, God, I saw me. He ran the wrong way. Hold up, I only got 10 seconds to kill you. I need you to relax. There we go. Now, <laughs> well, I guess you could stay down here. <laughs> Oh, there's one more up here. Might be more than one. But yeah, I feel like I like this build because it feels like I'm playing like some some type of sniper game, like Siphon Filter, or Hitman, or like, but with specifically with like, sniper rifles. Where the heck is this woman with the dirty mouth? I need to give her some five gum. Is it five gum? Or which is the one that cleans the dirty mouth? It's orbits, isn't it? Like, yeah, it's orbits. By the way, this is not a sponsored stream, not sponsored videos. I don't get any sponsor. Clearly, I don't get any sponsors. <laughs> And if she would stop cursing, maybe I could get some. <laughs> Dang. All the profanity. All the profanity. Ooh. A door I can actually open in here. Let's see what's down hallway number one. I can smell your fear. Huh. Easier way to talk take her down. Uh, that might have been the weapon that I'm looking for, honestly. <laughs> I don't know. Uh. Hold up. Nope, I found a weapon. Oh, uh, no, it's not a weapon, though. It's a motorcycle suit. Lame. I'll take it with lame. The thermal resistance is actually pretty good for me. Because I have no... You, you guys saw how much damage I took from a fire bullet. It's bad. Yeah, let's not look at our gaping wound of a head. Alright, we're gonna try this again. Let me in. Let me in! It's all racism. Every part of it. I don't know what their deal is. Got the data. Thanks, Pete. Get closed. I guess they're like backup. That was scheduled to come in, but they came a little bit late. <laughs> it's like, yeah, uh. They're just late help. Uh, wrong mega building. There we go. Look, 
luckily they named the one that you're supposed to come in a special name. Alright. Uh, sell stuff. I think this time we'll sell stuff instead of breaking stuff down. Um. I want this faster. Number two, maybe I want to use the money to buy my own car or something. I don't know. Or buy the Japan townhouse. I don't hate this playthrough so far. I actually, I'm nervous everywhere I go, but ultimately everything can be handled. I think that's basically my biggest takeaway. Like, it's not. It, you know, you pucker up on it on every uh, at every enemy, every crossing. It's not like you run in guns blazing, knowing that you're gonna win. Like. With the SMG build, it was just like, yo, I'm running guns blazing, and I know I'm going to win because I just have the damage output. Like, I, I just have damage output. Like, nothing's going to stop me from winning. Like, even if they shoot me, I'm probably going to shoot them back faster than they can actually kill me. Like, even if I'm a glass cannon on very hard, I just do too much. Now, you still care about getting shot. You still avoid getting shot as much as possible. But every time you see an enemy, they die immediately. So, it's not that hard to see enemies in, enemies in this game faster than they see you. It's really not. And if you see all of them in a pack, you just blow them all up. Or, I guess, shoot them all up immediately. And it's that's a good game. Oh man. All right, we got three mile. I like how oh the cops aren't there anymore. I like how there's cops there when you first show up and then they just go they just screw off. It's like, okay, we're done here now. Now that we're no longer a threat, we're no longer going to give you lots of level for uh, screwing up. Because they tempted me because they have the yellow arrow, so, you know, you got a yellow ar arrow in your head, I'm going to shoot you, especially on my first playthrough when I didn't know much better. Anybody who had a yellow arrow in their head, target. Like, you might as well just said shoot me. Now I'm just like, uh, let me double check that I actually want to shoot that target. Now, if you have a red arrow over your head and I don't have a wanted level already, yeah, you're, you're getting shot. 100%. Unless I can tell that you're a cop. Because cops sometimes be aggroing for no reason. It's really annoying. this one courier services oh I don't remember this one this one's kind of annoying actually <sighs> great that's what we needed oh well 
I think you can literally just go around back, right? Like, yeah, you can go this way, and that's cool. Or, 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 or. You can go this way. Oh, they closed the door on me? They're like, yeah, nah, you ain't doing that, bruh. That's fine. I'll figure out a way over that gate. <laughs> I would love ice pick, but it don't look like that's in the cards for us this time. Yeah? They gave me a really hard one, huh? That sucks. Okay, so that means I can't get both. So I'm gonna have to pick one and go with it. Um, I think here I pick Ice Pick. Yeah, I just pick Ice Pick if I can figure it out. Yeah, I'll just go that way out. I would love mass vulnerability, I really would. But I feel like I can do fatal damage without it, so I'm not gonna worry about it. Um Let's blow this guy up. Easier than trying to snipe him through a gate. Hopefully he does fatal damage to himself. Fortunately he does. He has the right grenades for it. For the job. Hey, look, it's a gate I can open. So I picked Ice Pick. I want to continuously hit those. As often as possible. Um, probably wasting my time, but let's try it. No luck. Oh, those are windows anyway.
Oh, what's this? Weapon? Oh, uh, here we go. We found a weapon. Um, tactician, legendary level. Noise. Uh, no guarantee that that's always what we're going to find, but we did find a weapon here. So, many ways to skin a cat. We found a legendary weapon in the back. Um, for from my point of view, I entered from the back, so I went I entered from the back right to the left. But it's on the first floor, back right. From my point of view, it's the front left. But from the real point of view, that where the mission leads you is front, uh, back right, under the staircase. So many tacticians, though. I hope that's not a real. That's not. A permanent gun. I hope that's actually a uh, one that can change. But even if it can change, then it just depends on what your seed is, unfortunately. So in somebody's game, it might be like the best gun possible, like a freaking Nikamata or a. Uh, oh, I forgot what what the uh, the, the Senko a Nikamata, a Senko, or a uh, what would the Holy Grail be? Uh, legendary Achilles, Nikamata, Senko, or. Uh, or Buria. Either of those would be like the gun, like the best possible. Like if you could get a legendary gun with a unique modifier on it, that'd be crazy. Yeah. These random power shotguns and power pistols are just they're garbage, honestly. Like there's better shotguns. These aren't a unique type of gun and it's really annoying. Like it's really annoying when you get all these. All right, what I'll do is I'll save it here, and then we'll check to see if that's if that changes. It should change. I doubt that's a permanent. I doubt that's a confirmed permanent. Like it's always going to be this. Oh yeah, yeah, it changes a lot. And the fact that it changes quality means to me it's probably one of those weapons that does actually, uh, it probably is a weapon that, uh, what you call it, what, it depends on your seed. So, it's probably a seed dependent weapon. And it's not def definitively a tactician. However, you cannot control what's going to come out of that box, unfortunately. Like, as soon as you start the game, that's decided, and you're just screwed. You just don't know. Um, I actually like that for shotgun a little bit. I prefer having the uh, sextuple um, kickback, knockback, but this that isn't bad either. This is a Fuyatsuki box, right? That's just a regular box. <laughs> During gig. Mini Wiz is gonna cap. This one is in north side. Oh, I should say inside com in fact inside building on bottom floor back right under stairwell. There. There we go. We'll take it. It's not like I'm going to use a tactician regardless with this build. That'd be kind of weird. Kind of weird. Alright, so with these dudes, they're kind of far apart. I thought they were closer together, unfortunately. They're not. 
So what I would like to do is for you, we're going to put you on a t-shirt immediately. And I'm going to ping the other one. Maybe that's not gonna shock you as well. There we go. Such a boss. Look at look at him. Such a boss. This is probably the smartest enemy we've seen so far. He actually went to where the sound came from. So he's gonna notify everybody that I'm here. Oh, actually, I don't think he can. Yeah, he can't. Because of uh, my ping. He can't notify anybody. <laughs> He can blow up though. He can definitely do that. That's one thing he's a bit, he's able to do quite easily. These tigers are so explosive, guys. Highly explosive tigers. Oh, is that a? Ah, I was hoping I could snipe through it. Lame. I guess this is another way I could have got up here from the back. Could have went through the top. You learn new angles to attack everything every time you come. Every time you do a, a quest, you just get to learn how many different angles they actually gave you to do something other than the one that you uh, are guided to. Like, oh, if I did this, this would have been easier. Um, yeah, but do I have a... Okay, I have a BD going that way. Never mind. Didn't matter. I think those are just literally just guys standing out front now. Fortunately, both of these guys lived. Anybody who, get, who could get hit my, by my detonate grenade has a non-zero chance of living. Like, they have a decent chance of living. Only because it depends on what their grenade is. If their grenade is non-lethal, then they get hit by non-lethal damage. If they chose to be a lethal user, then they'll they'll receive lethal damage unfortunately it is what it is I'm sorry I, I can't control that now if you get hit by my gun and you're definitely going to die because I, I took packs off or whatever it was that was letting people live through my shots I was like yeah no no we're not doing that get popped up won't let you live won't let you live, get popped up, won't let you live, no, won't let you live, get popped up. What's this? Oh, we got two in here. Okay, okay, we got an Omaha this time. This is the minimum charge required to penetrate walls by 50%. It's a tech pistol. Let's see what happens when we re-roll it. Um... Locked up, locked up. Yep, it changed quality to me. So like I said, 
that's a almost a guarantee that it's uh a what you call it. Was the Omaha always a tech charge pistol? I thought that was a I thought that was a what you call it gun. I thought it was a power pistol, huh? Omaha Cyberpunk. I could have sworn that was a power, a power pistol. Or it was supposed to be a power pistol. Maybe I'm tripping. I could be tripping. I could definitely be tripping. Oh, it is. It's supposed to be a tech pistol. Darn. Okay. Guys, I'm, I'm tripping, guys. I be tripping sometimes. Um, so it goes from... See, that's the perfect modifier. I just don't like the fact that it's now a epic instead of legendary like why didn't it just be legendary locked up won't let me out in in the case where the pistol fires automatically that might not even be the perfect well it depends it depends on your thought process would you rather have more damage like this i like this this is actually perfect for me. I like this because it's more damage, right? Per shot. Because once you actually start shooting, you all you want is the thing in front of you to die. Now, granted, this doesn't work for... Uh, it's questionable with pistols, actually. Tech is, tech is hard. Because normally you'd be like, yeah, I just want the, the half of that, that, that half off of uh, charge time. But I think this is valuable. I think this is very valuable. I think it is. If I want to respec in the pistol, that would be actually really strong. So I'm going to take it. I have enough strength to open something for once? Open sesame, boy. <laughs> Legendary steel pipe. Go figure. Yeah, you don't. So, if it's a legendary weapon, you don't get anything out of it. It's a Miltech box, though. Interesting. Um, I wonder if this could be something different. There's no way I'm going to be able to tell. Um, yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to tell. So, same gig. I got an Omaha, and then there's a steel pipe that's legendary. I don't know if that steel pipe is guaranteed, but I want to check it on a different seed. I really do. And unfortunately, I already did this on my other different seed that I already have, so there's no way for me to tell on that seed. What, what's the name of this gun again? The Omaha. M76. I've never written this down now. E. Omaha. Well, at least it's a more rare form. I wouldn't be mad if. It's probably a switcher. It's probably seed dependent, but I wouldn't be mad if it, uh. If it was the permanent option there. Because that's really good. Yikes. That charge time is long. Double check that. Okay. Yeah, that's a that's a actually I think half charge time would have been good there. That's a lot of charge time. Let's name this room. It's just like main computer. In safe in main computer.
five body door in the computer room. If it's a switcher, then that means that I believe, and this is still my theory, I have no way to prove it yet, but I believe if these, if the quality switches, if it switches quality, then that means that it switches weapons based on seeds. So I just got unlucky there, if that's the case. Let's find out. I'll put in my notes that's a possible switcher if it switches quality, if after I reload like a couple times. And we're looking at no, that's still that's still legendary. Yeah, yep, that's still legendary. Either way, getting a legendary still pipe is like pretty good for an area you can access immediately in the game. Oh yeah, it's a switcher. Yep. Now it's a uh now it's an epic. So switch is quality, I think. Let's see dependent. I don't know if that different weapon is all is always gonna be melee or a gun or what. Or it couldn't be again. But I think it can switch what it is. Alright. Funny enough, this particular box is driven off of uh I'm not gonna use that. Every time I use that it goes against me. I don't know where the enemies are. Downstairs. What they got? Crafting spec for a combat amplifier.
Area clear. Look at her. She's lucky too. Seven. That's different. City center, huh? I already checked up here, right? Yeah. this nothing good a forcible door Now we get to listen to the mellow tones of whatever's on the radio. I've never seen somebody try so hard to get, get themselves killed. They need to fix that AI that goes out of its way to get itself killed. That's really annoying. Oh, this one right here. You guys want to see another tactician? <laughs> I think this one's guaranteed, actually. Uh, 
Uh, it's farther than I thought it was. Get some mounts going. Roll mounts. Alright, remember this is the same spot where we did Hippocratic, Hippocratic Oath, you accept it's daytime now. So now that it's been over 24 hours, we can knock this out. Seven eight ninety nine. Do I have it? Do I have it? Do I have it? Where's, oh, actually, I don't need seven eight ninety nine. I need seven eight fifty five. Seven eight fifty five again. And following that. One CE nine. Um, before I do that, save game, just we like how things turned out, that grenade on these two, time to shock on this one. Yeah, memory wipe just to keep the rest of them out of combat when I screw up the shot inevitably. Ah, oh, feels good. Feels real good. All right. Not getting. Not getting run over as I cross the road always feels good too. I swear I won't do anything to you. Look at this, all the surveillance cameras aren't friendly anymore. Freaking guys love, love, love their uh, surveillance cameras. I'll, you, I'll tell you that. How long does the memory wipe last? I forgot. Duration 17 seconds. Let's hit with it again. And then we'll sonic shock. There we go. There we go. Can't hide. You know that. Oh great. I probably don't have a I do have a life available. I think it was still Sonic shocked. 
Or at least the other one was. Target him. I'll deck grenade on this guy. Oh crud. I'm fucked. Alright, well enough playtime's over, I guess. No more trying to be America's next top sniper. This guy, wherever he is. Yep, another tactician. Huh. Well, that is a different quality, which makes me. No, no, no. That's the same quality. It's a different mod. Um. So yeah, this third time he's fun. This third time he's given something different. Coming back here. Um. So, in my other seed, I got a, uh, a stick grenade crafting spec from that one. And I was pretty happy about that because it was the imp sticky. And then I came to this seed and I was like, oh, that's not a guarantee. Makes it so much less awesome. Oh yeah, is there anything in this bathroom this time? They just wanted to use the same asset twice. For different reasons. Mm, maybe the same reason, depending on how you look at it. But yeah. Um, I think this is just a lower version of something I already got. What's in here? Every time I see a blue box, I get happy because it, there's a chance that I'm gonna get a, uh, I'm gonna be able to find um, the crafting spec for homing poison grenades or poison grenades in general. If I could find a guaranteed spot for that, I'd be so happy. Like, even if it's, like, basic throw poison grenades, that would be better than what we have, which is nothing. Oh. Okay, crafting spec for anti-venom up here. I'm pretty sure that's seed-based. Like, if I save and reload, I'm, it's going to be the same thing. And then if I go, what the heck? the actual heck what were you supposed to do were you supposed to like come inside and like drop down see this is what I mean like this game gives you so many different ways to approach every single objective if you think outside the box chances are developers are thinking with you um. Another, there's another way in right there. Now I'm sure we weren't supposed to do this, like, cause I guess yeah, mate, well, mate, yeah, you could have jumped up from the outside, snuck in through here. Yep. And then yep, you're right above everybody. It's a perfect sniper nest. That would have been a better sniper nest than the one I picked, which was just like 
walking up from outside and <laughs> trying to blow people up, people's heads off. That's for sure. Now, it's kind of cramped up there, but it, it would work. Hey, I, okay, 7A, 1C. I'm just going to choose to believe that this is going to work. 55, 7A, and then I need to get to another 55 with a 1C and a BD coming off of it. BD is the hard one to find here. I don't think I got it. Yeah, there's no like easy way to get from anywhere to BD. Um, 1C, BD, or 1C. I'll look for 1C, E955. Okay, I can do that. Yeah, I just took number one since I couldn't get number two there. You like that sometimes? Uh, where is that? Is that like the, the rear rear of the building? Can't tell you honestly. Like the side of the building. It's still kind of towards the opening. The front of it. Probably would have had to do some, uh, some thought. Put some thought into it. There's so many different ways you can approach this. I'm not sure if that's a guarantee, by the way, this one here. Oh, okay. What is this, overheat? I'm going to go check a shop to see if this is a guaranteed uh, legendary, by the way. I'm going to do that and then I'm in the stream. By the way. Let's see what this crafting spec drops has if I reload. So, here's the thing. This crafting spec is not bad for my seed. And honestly, I need to... Actually, hold up. Why don't I just go check my other seed? I have another seed for this specific purpose. Yeah, okay. I'm pretty sure I didn't get this item on my other seed. So, I can go check the other seed real quick. Uh, this isn't a bad item to get, though. Anti-Venom is great. Um, the reason it's great for me is because it will allow me to uh, get an immunity to poison that I don't have because of my very low uh, cool. So I don't have an immunity to poison or to burning because of my low cool. So getting it via Anti-Venom is cool with me. Um, that's the missing ear guy. That's funny to me. I'll go that way. Let's load and figure out if we're going to get it from the other one real quick. So here's my other seed. Unfortunately, I think I do need to clear out the outside real fast. But after that, we'll be able to check that box real quick. I don't need to do all this extra work like clearing out the entire building. I just need to clear out the outside area. up there somewhere. Actually, I could start from here. Let's find out if this is a guaranteed anti-venom or if it's C-dependent. So, 
it's a whole di different new game. So as it's a different new game, it's gonna have different stuff. Any, anytime something C dependent, it's just not gonna be the same. Or it could be the same, but it'd be an extremely low probability of it being the exact same thing. Yeah, yeah, that's not it at all. Boy? I told you you could shoot me. Tell y'all where that was. See, completely different seed, and he's going to. Uh, I don't know who I'm in combat with, but. Captain Spec Unity, uh, he didn't drop a gun this time. Sometimes it'd be like that. And I can show you what I was talking about in this safe here. Captain Spec for Sensory Amplifier, Captain Spec for M Grenade. That's the sticky version. Ugh, I wish I had that. Look like he belonged in Borderlands. So broken. Sandivson. And the model wire just makes it even worse. Just super broken, broken. Love these speedy reefs. Lowering your quick hat a couple of times. If I'm not mistaken, this is like an electric one, right? Reminds me of Street Fighter when you just used to beat up the car. See what you could do with it. There you go. We're almost there. Scrap the photo where once it's on fire, it just blows up. Oh, okay. <laughs> Need a little bit more encouragement. See, I do have the cool to be immune to fire on this build, so I am. Matter of fact, instead of being taking damage from it, I believe I get more powerful. Yeah, I do 10% more damage. <laughs> and then, instead of da taking damage from poison, where is it? Is it immune system? Yeah, I regenerate health from it. And then I also have, uh, do I have the shock? One. Yeah, when affected by shock or EMP, armor increases by 50%. Oh. 
You can get all three of those with uh, 14 cool. I don't have 12 cool on my uh, sniper build for reasons. It's actually necessary, but it does make it necessary to think about trying to find stuff like anti-venom and all that because I can't... Uh... What? I can jack in? Oh. Even though I don't have a... Uh... Interesting. Oh, okay, never mind. It, it won't let me get anything from it, but I can jack in. That's annoying. I forgot what quick hack I just got from that access point, but I will make a point to go to a shop and check to see what my newest quick hack is. I should I should have gotten a whole lot of uh, uncommons and rares recently. So if that brand new 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 one is a uh, what's in your shop? <laughs> Nowhere nearby. Uh. Get it, nerd. We're going scooting. We're going scooting. Well, um, carefully. What? There's no way all my new items are. This is this is BS. This is absolute BS. Yeah, they're all sorted. They're not. They're not sorting them correctly. There's no way to tell what what it is. Yeah, because all I see are a whole... There's a ton of legendaries. Don't get me wrong. Like, I have way more legendaries here than I should. But... There's no way to tell what came in what order. Because it's all just... Yeah. Scabs keep... Someday, sure. Other day... Eh, whatever. There's no telling. Without just getting rid of all my excess stuff, there's no telling. Hmm. But alright. I'll call the episode here. So as always, I've been me. You've been you. And I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.